I have restrung. Oh my god, I've been gardening, and you can see. Um, I've lost snails as well. Ripped that one, and I've ripped that one. Anyway, I've been restringing my sister's necklace, and I went and cut it up again yesterday and redid it again. Oh, I wasn't happy. I meant to give it to her the other week, last week, and it never happened because I forgot to take it, and I'm quite pleased I didn't now because I've redone it. And um, I did. I made this years ago, and it came apart. So now I've managed to match up some beads and things. I've managed to match up some beads, and um, I'm quite pleased that I've managed to match things. Matchy matchy. Oh, what happens to? The... Oh yeah, there's some little tiny. They are not like the other amethyst on it, but at least they'll do for now. They're the nearest I've managed to find. There's a size 15, and they are minute. They're a nightmare. But anyway, this one here, I thought while I was at it, I'd make her a little bracelet to go with it. Because it's quite cute. So you can see it's not exact match, the amethyst. There's a slightly smaller, and I think I might make a little pair of earrings. But then I get to this end to go and put the catch on, so she can get it off and on, on her and off her wrist. And I've really screwed up here, so I'm picking it all apart again. How bad is that? Honestly, seriously. And then I'm sitting there faffing around, and I've managed to get the needle and the cotton and everything going through the mat, all over the place, and it's all a bit of a mess. And this is because I fell asleep while I was doing it. <laughs> so the threads and the mat have all kind of become one with each other. And um, the poor little bracelet, has, um, yeah, that I should have been doing. So I've got my steering done, but I need to pick unpick this. Because I don't know if you can see, it's actually incorrect. I don't know if you can see, that pattern doesn't isn't quite right. And I think I ought to add three beads at the top on each side instead of two, just as two. I think it will be... Um, easier with that little catch. These catches are quite good. It's actually magnetic. And um, if I put it sideways, if you get one of these magnetic catches, you should pull them sideways, not, 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 not that way. But you should pull them sideways. It actually puts less strain on the magnet. And um, yeah, they're quite cute. That's got quite a good pull on that one, even though it's tiny. It's a nice little magnet, magnetic catch. Anything is, also the other thing is, while you're actually stitching, it's not a good idea to keep your catch really wet. Because what happens is, the needle attaches itself to it, and um, yeah, that causes problems while you take. So, I shall unpick all of this, and um, redo that catch, and show you the results in a short while, a little while. <laughs> 